Hello everyone, today we are reacting to Top Pops as you can see on screen and today we are reacting to none other than his rare Funko Pops at the comic book store. Should be a good video, a good old Top Pops can never spoil anyone dares, so let's get into it. Today I wanted a pretty big Funko Pop on the first place that I went to was Walmart. Ooh. So we are in Walmart and they have a bunch of the concerts They're massive. Actually the last time we were here, they had this one that looks like it's still around. Which is too bad because honestly, the Matterhorn Pops and Attraction and Donald Duck is a really cool figure. It's I just already have the collection. Cool. And then it looks like they've got more yeah. concerts over here. Those look pretty here. cool, and pretty nice here. Interesting figures like Hawkman, as well as down here, the Mandalorian with Roku, which normally is a Target exclusive, but here in Canada, I guess we're getting it over at Walmart. And then they've got the original Black Box Darth Vader. I don't know why, but most Walmarts here in Canada have to getting this one in. <laughs> That ah, was a great catch. Anyway, sorry, I meant to show up the back there because this is like from the original wave. They just swapped it over to this black box. So, like, if you have the blue one, that's technically the original, original, but this is like the original Darth Vader. Does that make sense? And, anyways, the toy yeah, it goes, it does. The Star 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 which is just such a sick figure. And they actually made a bunch of different versions of this with different characters. Oh, and then one more thing over in this section before we go look for the other one because I swear there is another section here. Mm. Mm. Yes. They have the black mm. Adam exclusive movie bundle, which is kind of fun to check out. Uh, I found the other section that looks like there is some interesting stuff here. But now the question is, is there anything new from the last time? Uh, you know, I think so much, because I don't remember seeing the House of the Dragon one. We have had just a lot of stuff over the weekend, so it could bring out. Maybe it has melted, so. Oh, and then up at the top here, I noticed that they have three Shazams, which means they probably got the case, and I'm guessing they're going to be the case. That chase is probably gone. Okay, so I've got my pop, and now I want to go over to the Lego section because I'm looking Oh, we love Lego. We don't love them. And, uh, well, I got a lot of Lego, but I've not seen any brickheads. But you know what? The Minecraft sets are looking pretty snazzy. So, yeah, I did end up getting Minecraft sets. Now, I'm going to be honest with you. I don't think I'm going to get that one because it's kind of hard to get a good quality. I'm just going to mess around and see if I can get the quality good, so I'll bring you back in a couple more minutes. Fortunately, I can't do what with the quality. So yeah, I just stuck with this rubbish quality. I've just rewinded it a bit, so... Okay, so I've got my pop, and now I want to go over to the Lego section, because I'm looking for a bunch of the new brickheads, and I want to see if they've got them. And I'm presuming it means with those, the Disney ones. Well, they are pretty sick. But you know what, the Minecraft sets are looking pretty snazzy. So yeah, I did end up oh, getting these... Oh, by the way, guys, we did a video on those Disney brickheads. Go check it out. Link down below. Which is one that I've kind of been debating on for a little while, and I didn't want to miss out on this and it'd be like sold out everywhere, so I just went for it. And also, it's kind of funny because looking on the back here, yo, that looks sick. For, I want to say wow. years like, now, like maybe cool. since like 2018. This is not a new set, but something I do find kind of funny is that this is now the 3D renders, not the 2D ones like the original boxes. Well, it is really so definitely an interesting update. And also, I just noticed now that I don't know why it's so blurred. Oh. I'm sure we've got that, but... Yeah, right. Ah! Oh. Oops. Let's just put it back on. Um, yeah, I'll bring you back in a minute. Right, so that advert's finished. Sorry, guys. Sorry for... I, mean, I don't know what's happening with this reaction video today, but anyway, let's go. Right. It's also kind of in this weird pose you don't see very often with Pops. Okay, now everybody, we've come over to Dollarama. This is one that I don't think I've ever been to, so let's check out the section here. And don't trust me. Oh, they do have G.I. Joe, but I am, uh, let's look, I've not seen any Pops. Oh, I do have some. Oh, neat. These are different ones that I've seen Whoa. here before. They've got Particula as well as Trinity and... That's it. That was what I need for the Simpsons collection. Actually, every word is ones I need for the Simpsons collection because I've only got one. Not even a, the Greek ones, just one Simpsons one. Um, I think that's it. Just, just the two of them. Oh, and then like usual over here, they have some of the foodies plushies mm. with the trick cereal as well as Fruit Loops. But I've got both. Imagine things. that as a bar. Oh, no, hold on, guys. On the other okay. side of the aisle, they actually had more Funko Pops as well as Mighty Mugs. And it seems like they've got Infinity Killmonger, Cersei, Player Four, Five, Six, and I think that's it. But still cool to see more for five bucks. And as you guys can tell, I didn't pick up anything while I was there, but it was nice to still check. Then we went over to Studio 151, which is a giant Pokemon store, but they also have a lot of pops. And as you guys can see by the section, they have a 
really great selection of Pokemon. And because I have most of the Pokemon figures already, I didn't pick up any of them, but they did get to show me these two here. It is the first ever Pokemon Whoa. Center exclusive Pikachu. Mine haven't arrived yet in the mail, but they got theirs, and they look pretty cool. And if I'm going to be honest, seeing it in person, it now is a little bit more than just like a pro lesson. The box also really helps that they switched it up. And now I'm super curious as to what's going to be the next exclusive for Pokemon Center, because I believe they announced like six or seven of them. And so if you guys have any yeah. ideas, or maybe you just think they're going to be all I think pro the lessons that we've done already, please drop it in the comment section below. And so now I did actually end up picking up something while I was there, mm -hmm. and I want to show you guys what I got, because the first thing this I got... This turned into a little fun topic. Talk about the video. There's probably not a Mewtwo in this set, but I just enjoyed this so much. And I don't know, these Pokey binders, I really like them. Like, they just feel a little bit more substantial, especially when you're going to be doing an entire set and not just throwing in, like, random cards, you know? And actually, now that I think about it, I don't even know if there's a Mewtwo in the set, so you never know, but I believe the main two are Arcanine and Gyarados. Or at least that's what I've seen, so I'm not 100% sure. Then I also ended up grabbing this stuff here, and now I did already open up the ETB. I got, but then I also ended up getting a single as well as a pack of vintage Pokemon cards. This is something that they just have in the store. Last time Nate and I went, they did not have these in stock, so I figured today I might as well try my luck on one. And then also, before I show you guys the single that I grabbed, I figured it would be fun to show you guys the hits that I got inside of here. There are 10 packs, and well, I did pretty decent. Alrighty, so here are the six different things that I pulled out of the Where are the popcorn pop? pop where are the Funko Pops that are in this thumbnail? That I'm going to make a thumbnail lovely later. Oh, we're getting this. There we go. We've got another six minutes of this, so might be a bit of a long video for so us. Oh, well. Tank, which is kind of neat there, the trainer gallery. Oh, a Pikachu. Pikachu. Which is nice because I do already have this one, but I'm going to be throwing it into my Pikachu binder. Then I got this Rayquaza V, and I don't believe mm -hmm. I have this one. I'm not 100% sure because there are two in the set that are very similar. And then after that, check this out. We got a Hatterene V-Star, and then we're getting into the crazy stuff. Check this one out, guys. Sharon's Care, and then wait for it, wait for it, wait for it, a Zorar V-Star. Whoa. I don't actually have any of this one in the collection, so I thought it would be fun to Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. And that's why I finished music class. Literally. Like hollows, rares, and of course, let's find out what 10 cards I got. And it looks like every single one of these are slaves. Let me just flip this one to the back and then we'll go through there. So. We've got, actually, this one's really neat. Oh. It is Eevee. I'm not going to be able to tell you guys exactly Ooh. what sets they're from. Oh. Because they are a little chicken. small on the screen, but I mean, come on. Oh, wait I a don't second. think that was a it chicken. It is a Japanese Squirtle. And I know that this one here has Bubble Beak. Oh, wow. Take a look at this, guys. That is some mm, original no. back art there. And I believe this art was only on the Japanese pack, so really cool to see here. And then it looks like we've got another Eevee. And by the way, okay. these packs here were $20. Right so I think it's pretty Ah, this is right. We have had two things on hold for me. And so I got this big box. Whoa. I'll show you guys what I picked up because there was, of course, like big behind box. the counter where they got their extra figures. Big, 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 big box. Big oh, box. Oh, 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 oh. Big, 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 I've got big, big. that pop. I've got that pop. I've got that pop. I've got that pop. That rare zombie fall, zombie fall. Expensive figures. And some that stand out to me is like Jack Sparrow, as well as the original Joker, Jimi Hendrix. As well as like Jack Sparrow. Oh, Jimi Hendrix. The original Turtles. And then above that. Even if I find that for a cheap price, I'm happy to pick it up. This was my 11th item for the day. I guess that's what it would be. And then the other one that I got, because we've all been watching South Park recently, and I believe I talked about this I in the store. Really I really don't like South Park. While I was there. And this is a really great one. It is Stan. I mean, come on, how funny this is. And you know what, now that I'm looking on the back here, I believe I mean, this is now perfect. my second one from the set. Because I really Again, if it's worth a really cheap price. For this year, I now have Stan and Osamo. Awesome I gotta get more of these guys, though. Then I was looking at their new 
tribal section at the front, and I found some really interesting stuff. It was actually a bunch of sodas for the brand new Black Panther set. And I did not want to miss out on these, so I decided to go for two of every single one that I was missing because they did get in the Anika a little while ago, and I got both the Chase and Common, so I lucked out with them. But when it comes to Black Panther, Namor, Babaku, and I believe this one here is Okoye, yeah, I want to try for every single one of these. And also, mm -hmm. they did do some feeling while we were there, and he thinks that I did get the chase for at least Namor, maybe some more too. The nice thing was they had an entire case yeah. for all of them, but I'm going to be saving that for a later video because I don't yeah. have a lot of fun with that. And then everybody, I also picked up two sodas that I'm going to be opening up today. It is the previous exclusive Moon Knight, which I do not have the chase for yet. As well as a brand new one that they just got in. It is Elvira. And I know the chase for this one is her with the red dress holding a heart, and I really do want to get that one. Because it would be nice to have another Diamond Edition chase in the collection. Now, before we open up these, I do want yeah, to Yeah, it would be nice to have another chase in the collection. one that I've really been wanting, and we've actually had it there for a little while, so I'm glad I did get it. It is this one, the Disney's Emile from Ratatouille. I just love this thing. Yo, I if I find that for a good price, like so 20, 25, Remy, and I saw that Funko it with the chase, mm -hmm. so that's why I didn't go for the one they had in stores, like the original one. I decided to wait to maybe find that Remy in the future. And also, I do already have the Remy box such exclusive where he's making Ratatouille, so I have one in the collection. It's just not the one from the original set, like you see on the back here. And so I guess everybody, it is now time. Let's get into these. Now, I want to say, soda let's time, see soda time, soda, oh, soda, 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 soda time, time, soda time, time soda, soda time, yeah, soda, 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 soda. One of them that had been pulled from the Elvira's, and he got three cases of them, so we got some pretty good luck today. And now let's find out if we did end up getting Moon Knight. And I believe for this one here, it is just a glow in the dark version, so it might be a little bit hard to tell. And you know what? Um, I don't know. Ooh. We're gonna check the fog on this. Alrighty, here we go. This is just the normal Moon Knight. Pretty good looking soda. What are you gonna do? We can always try again in the future. And now let's just get very white in it. Right here. And the nice thing is with this soda is that I don't have any of them, so I don't really mind. But that chase would be nice. So here we go. Let's find out if we did end up getting it. Ah, uh, I can't see yet. All I see is her hair. Okay, let me see if I can get this hair. Two, one. Ah, I still can't see it. Ah, no. This is the black dress, Elvira. Oh, she's got like a dagger in the front there. Okay, this is the kind of weird what one. The? What I think still a really well done soda. Well, like interesting soda. Like Elvira. They made her hair super tall. And if you guys are curious, this one here is normally 20,000 pieces, and the common is limited to one out of 16,700. So not that rare, but then again, still a fun one to have. And well, anyways, guys, there you go. That oh, is that it? Hunt for today. Right, so that's it, guys. Hope you guys have a good one. Like I said, everything will be linked in the description. Bye!